Meet Thunderbit, an AI-powered web scraper which turns messy websites into clean, structured data in just seconds with just two clicks. No coding, just pick a page, set your rules and let the AI collect your data. Just automatically. Perfect for research, lead gen and competitive analysis. Let's go in. So first you go on Thunderbit.com. Here you have an overview about the tool. You can scrap your data from websites in just two clicks powered by AI. If you scroll down a bit, you see some examples here. To get started, just install it in your Chrome and after signing up you get this here. So first you choose the data source like the current page or URLs and the scraper template. Let's test it with the playground. So we have this website here with the different leaderships here and we want to extract the data in a structured document. So our data source is the current page and our scraper template is the fields which the data will be structured in. We can use AI to suggest the fields. Just click on it. It's so fast. He extracted the field names for these leaderships here. We can adjust things here but we want to just scrape his fetching the data from the website and 10 seconds later we have our result here if you look at it we have the whole page structured here in a table very nice very easy in just two clicks we can copy the whole content or download it we are excel csv or json if you look at the json file here and as we can see it did the job very well we also have the urls from the profile images if you look at it, it just works very nice so let's use Thunderbit in the real world. We have a travel agency here with a leadership again. We want the current page, we want suggest fields. There are only three fields, the name, the job title and the profile image, that's fine. We can also edit fields here like this one. We want the job title in German, save, scrape. And if we look at it, we have our job title translated in German works very well very good so now we have a more complex one here the walmart.com shop first we want to select our data source the current page with pagination we scroll down here is the pagination we click on the next button now we can scrape the data to the last page or just some specific pages let's hit two for this one we hit done we scrape the fields and now he's detecting sub pages because thunderbit also scrapes the sub pages of each product or item to get even more data let's skip it for now so he extracted some data like the product name the current price the original price the rating and the number of reviews if we hit scrape now he will scrape the current page and also the pagination till the page we entered so now he's on the second page he's extracting the data and after a few seconds we have our over 200 rows and after some seconds we have our result here it's well structured there are no mistakes it's just perfect and as we saw before we have also the sub page thing for example we want to have this page again on the bottom here you can scrape sub pages it should scrape from the product rules is now reading the sub page and we have the new fields which are in the sub page of its item we can now remove some let's remove some here so he has all product images the brand and some key item features which are listed here let's save it and just hit scrape because there are so many product rules he has to scrape we have two options here we have the browser scraping or cloud scraping in the description it says browser scraping is a bit slower but accurate and the cloud scraping is just faster it just means if you have private websites with a login you use the browser scraping if you have just public websites like the walmart.com here you can use the cloud scraping which is way faster and if we hit continue here as you can see he just scraped all pages here and extracting the data of each product website will take a bit and now it's finished he scraped all the data let's look at it and here we go you have all product images now the brand and the key item features it's so easy to use it and understand it. As usual, if you liked it, try it. See you in the next one.